Alright, so anyways, chew on the canoe. Let me give you all some backstory as to how it all went down. So I was chilling in my room, you know, it's like a Wednesday night. Uh, like 30 or 40 girls back there, 50 girls. And, um, uh, you know, I'm cooking a few beats. I'm cooking a few. I got, you know, 10, 15, 20 beats, 30 beats, 40 beats, 50 beats, 60 beats. 70 beats but at a certain point i was like trying to do that awkward thing where i'm trying to kick them out of my house without being direct so i'm like all right well it's getting kind of late but they would not take the hint they were they were trying to get me to make one more beat and i was like not going for it um but eventually you know i gave in i was like all right fine i'll make one more beat so i put on my headphones i'm getting in the zone so I'm cooking up the beat. Uh, it's going pretty well. And, uh, you know, the girls, they're really into it. But uh, eventually, I just, I started feeling dizzy. My left arm started tingling a little bit. And I was like, oh no. I heard about this. And then my chest started hurting. And I was like... And I, I was like, someone call 911. Like, they were laughing because they thought I was joking. But I was not joking my chest started hurting more and more and I literally I kid you not this is a true story you might I don't care if you believe me or not I became the first teenager in the United States of America on that night to have a heart attack in my room while making beats and I literally had a heart attack I fell on the ground and had a heart attack so I was like halfway through the beat and I had to go to the hospital and um, I'm on the way to the hospital. I'm in the back of an ambulance. And I'm like, all I can think about the whole time is I need to finish that beat. So I call one of the girls up. And I'm like, <clears throat> you know, I can't even barely talk. So I'm like, <clears throat> get my laptop. So we pull up to the hospital. And they're like trying to do all these dumb tests on me and whatever. And I'm like in this chair and they, they got all these tubes hooked up to me. And I'm like trying to yank them out. And I'm like, how about you guys just cool it, all right? They seem confused and alarmed, but I don't know. Anyways, I was just trying to get my laptop. So I get the girl to bust into the room. She was being chased because she was not supposed to be back there, but she, she comes in, she has my laptop, and she gives it to me. And I look in the bag, and I'm like, where's my charger? It looks like she's ashamed. And I look at her again, and I say, where's my charger? she's like i forgot it and so i say get out of my sight and she goes so i'm like i got 10 percent battery left and i'm at the hospital i gotta finish this beat right now the nurses are getting really mad they're telling me put the laptop down but i just won't do it so i'm like fighting nurses at the same time as trying to open up fl studio i had to do it like on the laptop speakers so it was just impossible but i finally finished it up and then um, I ripped all the tubes out of myself and they were at that point, they were freaking out. They were like, you got to get back down in that chair right now. But I ran out of the hospital. I had no clothes on. It was a whole situation. But I went home, I plugged in my laptop and then I posted the beat on YouTube. And that's how it all went down. Six months later, um, I'm getting comments that are like, that say like Jew on the canoe. And I don't know what they're talking about. So I look it up and I find this song that has like 200,000 views already and it's my beat. And I was like, this is kind of insane. So, uh, yeah, that's how it all happened. All right. So I'm going to just go through each instrument and show you all how I made the beat. Uh, I started off with this like bass brass layer. Everything kind of builds off this. And then next I added like this harp for like the driving force of the tempo. And then what really turns this John up is these timpanies right here. It really makes the whole beat. I used to play these back in the band days. I was back in the band room just pounding on these things. I was just... <clears throat> 
Um, then I had this bell here. I used to play this in the band too. I used to just whack that thing. Man, I used to go crazy on some bells back in the day. I would always miss the cue though, and I would I would just try to guess like where I'm supposed to hit it, and I would just smack that thing. Yeah, it was um it was different times back then. Uh then I had this ambience here. Makes it kind of eerie. This is like a really realistic brass instrument that I got for some reason. It took me like 13 days to download, but this is like the top melody for the whole beat. Man, it sounds like I was really kissing the brass, but uh, it's fake. So if you play a brass instrument and think you're going to get paid for it... <gasps> And then the last thing was this uh, sub bass here. I had to throw a slide in there. Um, so yeah, that's how, that's all the elements. Here's what they sound like all together. And then after that, it was on to the drums. So, started off with this 808. And then I had like a reverse 808 in there too. A little. Um, the next, it was on to like the hi-hats and perks. It's really excessive and annoying, so I don't like it, but it's what I made, so. Um, then after that, I had this kick. I switched out the 808 with the kick to give it just different energy. That's like the real driving rhythm. And then after that, I just had this snare. And uh, that's pretty much it for the drums. Here's what the drums sound like all together. So yeah, that's that. Um, and then after that, the only the last elements were just this swoosh here, and then this like Tom Clancy sound. I don't know, like some night vision goggles. And then uh, yeah, that was it. So here's the whole beat right here. I'll let it play through. So yeah, that's it. Let me know what y'all want to see next, and I'll see if I can make it happen. And uh, follow me on Instagram, at SnapBeats. And uh, I hope you all have a beautiful and blessed day.